Hi guys, I want to take a video showing uh, some of the FRC, FRC stuff that I've been working on. I have our laptop here and I have a waveform chart here and you'll see what this is for in a second. And I have a motor here with an encoder and then obviously my uh, input. Now what I've been working on this year is a uh, PID loop that's built into the speed controllers and right now I'm doing some tests on uh, setting the speed with the left and right analog stick and then uh, having the motor go at that appropriate speed. So let me start it up real quick. As you can see on, as you can see on the screen there's a couple of waveforms. The red waveform is the current draw. It's the scale divided by uh, 10 so right now it's averaging around uh, two and a half amps. The green line is my set line and the yellow line is my uh, actual red speed from the encoders. I'm using a PID value of uh, 0.05P, 0.01I, and 0.5D. And as you tell, uh, right now it's because I don't have it centered, it's going all over the place, but uh, as you could tell real quick, the tracking is pretty good. And you could tell on the screen that the yellow line is tracking it pretty damn well. So whatever, I sp whatever speed I set with the controller, that's the speed the motor will go. And this is just testing, I don't have a, a zero threshold, that's why it's kind of oscillating. But as you can tell on the monitor, uh, I have maximum speeds of about uh, negative 1000 RPM and then also 1000 RPM. And my range is 1100 and negative 1100 as you can see on the chart. So if I max it out one way, you can see it can't actually physically reach the set speed. I'm saying the other way, but uh, as you can see, I mean, this is all live. You can hear the motor changing speed. As I mean, the tracking is, pr I mean, the lines are pretty much overlapping. You can see a little bit of oscillation on the actual set speed. Get a constant value. You see, it settles in pretty quickly, and it uh, has very minor oscillation. That oscillation is uh, within, I would say, 20 RPM of uh, what you set it to. So it seems to work pretty well. And this is the first year we're using uh, the Jaguars with the built-in uh, speed control mode. This uh, constant velocity, not constant velocity, but uh, PID controlled velocity mode. So as you can see. It works pretty well. So far we're pretty happy with it and we'll probably be using uh, this type of system on the robot this year. I mean that's, I don't think you could get any better PID tracking than that. Alright, thanks for watching. See you next time.